subtle. Uh, my God Almighty, he wants to do evil. And, and come under the radar and get you to agree with him. Uh, but we fight the beast. Come on, church. We identify him uh, in every area. It's subtle thing. We identify him. John 31, 34. He said, did I fear a great multitude? Did I fear a great multitude? Is that my fear? No. Or did the contempt of families terrify me? My God. Which one of them? Is it the great multitude? Is it the great multitude? No, it's not the multitude. It's the contempt of families. This is in the Bible. That I kept silence. And went not out of the door. That's the, that's the number one. Brothers and sisters. Can I tell you something? The Bible said a king is not without honor. He's not, he has honor. The Bible says he has honor. Except in his own family. Come on. He said. The Bible said. A man's enemy. Shall be where? That of his own household. That's what the Bible said. He, the Bible said, Matthew Matthew 10 35 for I have come to set a man at variance against his father and the daughter against her mother and the daughter-in-law against her mother-in-law. What is the number one threat to God's movement? You think it's outside force? It's not outside. Okay. But that, oh, how do I know? It's all over the Bible. So I can't use one scripture and make doctrine. Are you there? It's all over. When Joseph said, Brothers, I got a dream. God show me this. For no reason other than jealousy. They fought against Joseph to the point that they said, We're going to kill him. We're going to kill him. Yes. My God. And, and, and because one, one I, I don't know, God troubled him. And he said, no, he's our flesh and blood. They, they got so mad. They got so consumed to the point where they said, we're going to kill our own brother. We're going to kill him. And one said, all right. Don't kill him because he's our brother. We're going to sell him. My God. How about David? When David said, what's going on with this Philistine? He called and said, what is this? What was his brothers got upset with him? So you come from mischief. David had to say, what have I now done? Is that there, there a cause? Reggie, there's a cause. The devil don't want you to get to the cause. He don't want to get to the root of the matter. He don't want you to deal with the situation at hand. It's the Bible said it. Right now, there's conflict in the world. Nations are warring. What if, what if the peaceful nation didn't have arms? What if they didn't have arms to defend against it? The wicked devils, the peace. They'd be dead. Because they need them no good. It's just because they have arms. And just because they defend themselves, the news fight against them. The people of the world fight against them. And who are they? They are God's people. And, and, the, and the parallel with, with them is that the converse when they fight against them is the Christians they want to fight. They're not saying anything. Yeah, well, they consider, listen, they call, they call Israel the little devil. And U.S. the big devil. They put them, lock them. But why did they associate the U.S. like that? Because we're a Christian nation. Because of the, the nation that's causing there to be some type of stability on the earth. So to the devil, the beast can have his way. So he devised the fight. Come on. To fight against the children of God. The Bible said the beast come with subtility. He come. All right. Watch this now. Solomon was supposed to be. Yes, Solomon's supposed to be king. Yes, Solomon's supposed to be king. 
who, who, who helped him to secure the, king, the kingdom? His mother. His mother. She said, look what's going to happen. My God, is, the kingdom is in danger. I thought David, the David you said it was for Solomon. And Solomon and David had to respond to protect it from who his brother. Right? But the very same mother, later on, once he had the kingdom, once he, once he was ruling over it, now he, she went back to the enemy, or the enemy came to her and said, Listen, I have an innocent request. Yeah. Oh, oh. What's wrong with that? Oh, nothing is wrong. I just, listen, yeah, I need a wife. <laughs> What's wrong with a wife? I, have the, I need a wife. I, I get a wife, right? The Bible said you must marry. So there's nothing wrong with getting a wife. But this, 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 this man was subtle because he was being led by the beast. He was subtle, Adonijah, yes. And, and he came and said, can I, let me get, let, ask, ask the king if I can get Abishad. Who's Abishad? Abishad is, is, belongs to David. Abilam is, Abishad belongs to David, was given to David. So, so in a sense, is David's wife. Are you there? So guess what now? When, when the, when the, the mother came in, who has done good, has done him good in the past, has done him good in the past, she came in and she said, listen, my son, you, you don't deny me, I have something to ask you, but don't deny me. Yeah, am I your mother? Do you love me? Come, yeah, please, yeah, if I'm your mother, if I'm your mother, you're supposed to listen to what I'm telling you right now. And he said, and he said, all right, mother, I'm not going to deny you. You're my mother. But when he heard the words that came out of her mouth, he knew it was the subtlety of the beast. He knew it was not the words of his mother. The people have to understand that even when you have your loved ones, when you have your family, when you, it's not them. You have to know the words of the beast. You have to know the actions of the beast. How could you hate your own flesh and blood? You're not going to hate your flesh and blood. You're not going to. You're not going to hate your mother, your father, your brother. It's the beast. It's the devil that 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 has given them an assignment to rise up against what God has fought for you to get done. Are you there, church? Are you there? So the, the woman said, "Yes, let me talk to him. I'll talk to him." And she took up the assignment. If, if you read the Bible, you see the way she carried it. She, she wasn't just giving a, 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 a report, so to speak. She wasn't just giving it, a, amen, what she heard and transferred. She took it on to herself and she, and she find ways to make sure, amen, to try and make sure it stick. Amen, that's what you call an evil assignment, church of God. Amen, but you must identify it. If it's even in your mother, come on, you're not helping me. Is the Bible said it? I got to say what the Bible said. Amen. The Bible said, if a man don't hate mother and father, more than he is not worthy of me. But the word is God. You're going to follow what God said. You're going to go by the leading of God. You're going to follow. You're going to be in line. You're not going to be out of line. You're going to be in order. You're not going to be out of order. There's a lot of, there's a lot of people coming with all type of words, side words. Variant, var, variated word, uh, and a doctrine, spurious doctrines, side doctrine. Why you don't love? Who love? love who don't love like the church? If Harvest Army didn't love, would you be here? Harvest well, well. Army boasts itself by by saying we are the we are the we, we evangelize mostly on the street. Hardly any people from other churches come here. So what are you talking about? The Bible said, greater love had no man than this, that a man lay down his life for his friend. You know, the thousands and millions of dollars spent on souls and travels. Yes. For what? Because there's no love. That's crazy talk. There's no love. Yeah, but, but love, the Bible describes love, patient time, long suffering. But look, the Bible talks about different aspects of love. The Bible said, who the Father loves. Now come on, you don't want to chase me. So now you say it's not love. If God loves you, he said he himself chasing us. Yes. And, and 
And because we get chastened and corrected, we, it's not love. What does what does any leader have, have to gain for you to be upset with them personally? What's the point? If I see you're gonna perish, I have to just leave you and say, okay, so be it. Let them go. But be, I'm gonna stop you, but you may not like it. I so said, what you doing? You don't see it. that that path is leading to destruction. If the Bible said it, I believe it's in, in, in Jude, which says so you have to snatch them on the fire. Oh, is that that's gentle? That's nice. Everything is not gentle. You have to show strength when you fight the beast. The devil comes to steal, kill, and destroy. And I must sit down and have tea with him. Matthew 11, 12, from the days of John the Baptist until now, the kingdom of heaven suffered violence, but the violent taken by force. Why were we omitting those parts of the scriptures? Why are we omitting them? Those are in the Bible for protection of the sheep. Oh, and fearings for God are the content of families. Believers, we're all families. We're all family. We're all, because Jesus said, who's my family? It's them that do the will of my father. It's them that do the will of God. So if you're doing the will of God, you are my family. Yeah, but every man, but the Bible said, every man has to give an account. For your own soul, come on, church of God. You have to make sure, amen, that you're on the right side. Because many will come in my name, saying I'm Christ, and shall deceive many. Because Matthew 7, 21, not everyone that said unto me, Lord, Lord, shall enter. Content of families. It's the content of families. It's not the multitude. It's the content of families. There's the believers. The number one thing is the content of families. And the enemy has a plan right now. I'm just speaking as the Lord. Give me an, I'm going to give it up. The enemy has a plan to surround families of those who are standing against the beast. The enemy is doing that right now. How is it that they don't talk to your, your, your husband, but you can talk to them? They can be a big friend with them, and you and your husband are one. How is that? Oh, how comes? How comes? They don't talk to your father and, and, and try to fight your father. But you and them are friends. The Bible said, a man shall leave his father and mother and cleave unto his wife. And the two shall become one. How can you be friends with somebody who despises your partner? How does that work? Listen. Listen, it's deeper than what I'm saying. It's, it's very bad. It's very bad. That means you're not the same person. You're taking over. It's not you. Because you have to evaluate. We got a clarity. We said, who changed? Did the message, the gospel message change? Did the leaders change? Huh? Did the church change? Did the doctrine change? Did the stance change? Ah! Or did you change? Here, you come here talking about yeah, it, uh, 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 what is it? Bless the Lord. That, 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 that God boasting God. Talking about boasting God. Then who's who we boasting? Mm. Who do we boasting? Mm. We boast in God. Oh, yeah. who, who could do this? Who could, who could let fish come from far from the heaven? show up. When did anybody ever claim any glory that belongs to God? The blood of Jesus is against contrariness. The Lord rebuked the contrary talk. Come watch yourself. Look how long God has used the army to impact the world and is standing. So you want to despise fruits after all these years? You want to despise everything that's been happening? All of a sudden, you know you have the revelation. You are the leader. 
You know how, how things must go. Come in with big word. But you better humble yourself. Humble yourself under the mighty hand of God. Who come, come diagnose anything. Ask God. Hey, did he hear from God? God is not confused. You can see all the proof. The, the, one young man asks a leader in the church. He said, oh, I know this is the right place and this is the church. He said, you the, the fruit, the family, faith, fire, fulfillment. You have to measure those things. You have to look at them. It's not some emotional roller coaster. Oh, I feel this way. I feel that way. Oh, because the pressure come on and you can't, you can't, you feel like you can't handle the pressure. So you talk soft and you back up. The devil is a liar. You're going to stand against the beast. Ah, having done all to stand. Come on, somebody stand. Watch for the content of family. Watch for every spouse that's not working with, with, their, with their spouse that God raised up. Watch for every child that's not working with their with their leader or their father who God raised up. Watch, watch for them. Be talk and everything. Watch yourself. This is in love. This is love. People don't have a monopoly on love. God described what love is. Love is chastening. Love is admonition. Love is warning. So that you don't go to hell. If the watchman see, amen, the arm is coming and don't warn the people. The Bible said that his blood, the blood will be upon his shoulder. Amen. Come on. But if he warn the people, then the blood is on their own shoulder. Receive correction. Receive the love of God. That's the love you need to preach about. Multitude. Read again. Did I fear a great multitude? No. Or did the contempt of families? He didn't say I, I was afraid, afraid of it. He said terrified. Oh family, family know about more about you than anybody else. My God, my God. Family know what, what you like, what you don't like, what you need, what you don't need. So because we have inside knowledge, then, amen, the devil come around them, amen, to cause them to try to tear down what God said for you to do. Yeah. But Job had to stand up. Yes, sir. How many wives or how many spouse would get offended if you say you sound foolish? <laughs> Very good. Job said you speak like a foolish woman. Very good. Who, who was deceived? Don't leave me alone because the Bible says, Who was deceived? Yeah. Was, it the, was it the man or the woman? The woman! The woman. Yeah. <laughs> Who was deceived? My God. But the man should have stood up yes, sir. in the face of adversity. The man should have stood up. The man should have covered. Oh my God. Even though, even though, they might, they might not want to talk to you. They don't want me, you don't want me to be real. They might, they might despise the Bible. When we learn about contempt, contempt is despise. Yeah. It's scorn. Yeah. It's hate. Oh. Mm. Oh. Mm. Oh. Jealous. Oh. Don't care. I don't care what you got to say. Yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Brothers and sisters. Many people mix it, mess this up. They mix it up. This is this is this is deep love. I'm trying to tell somebody. You don't feel like it. The Bible said no correction. When you get it, feel what? Joyous. Joyous. That's what the Bible said. Yes. Everything I'm saying is in the Bible. So you can look at it. I, I'm following the Bible. But this is deep love. When you get a, a, a wound that, amen, that, that's getting infected. So they have to go deep sometimes I even cut around it. Is that gonna is that you're gonna enjoy that? But it's what's necessary so that there's no infection. If a serpent bites you, they may have to amputate. So that so that the venom don't spread throughout the whole body and destroy the person. Oh shut up like that. The content. Don't scorn. Don't scorn who, who God put up. Don't scorn who God said to hell. Every family have, have, a, have a savior in there, so to speak. 
You give me a better word. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Every, every God sent somebody in the family to help deliver yeah. in that family. Don't, don't fight them. Don't fight them. What if, what if God was a leading Joseph? He had, to, he had to tell his brothers. He said, don't worry yourself, man. All the, all the wickedness that you did to me. He never said it like that. It's me saying it like that. Yeah. All the wickedness and the murder you that's the thing some people don't understand that if you get the visionary to let go if you get those that God said to let go it's the end of you some people don't get that but I pray God stand up stand up with me God I pray you help us to get this Father help us to judge ourselves that we be not judged Father, help us to see our wrong before it's too late. Yes, Lord. Lord, every one of us, every one of us, Lord Jesus, have done something that we need to check and repent for. Oh my God. So Lord, help us, Lord, even, even while we preach, God, we, we check ourselves because we don't want to be in contempt against who God set up. My God, who God has blessed, no man curse, Lord Jesus. Like, like oh my God, oh God, Father, in the name of Jesus, open our eyes to your love yeah. and understand, Lord, that God has brought Horace army this far. Hey, oh my God, through prophecy and revelation yeah. and has continued to, to cause us to outrun the devil or with the peace or of looking Overthrow him in the name of Jesus. Paying off the, the mortgage. Yeah. Mortgage burning over half a million dollars. Over 600,000. In 30 days it was over. Suddenly over by God's power. The, the same God that have led Harvest Army to purchase a world, the, the world revival city. The same God who have released thousands and thousands of prophecies and revelations that have come to pass. Have led us this far. So, Father, I pray you open our eyes, open the eyes of your people that they see. Yes, Lord Jesus, that they see the love of God. God, you said, you, you said, you, you will leave the 99 and go for that one, God. Oh, my God. God, I, 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 I minister to that one, Lord. I minister, Lord, did the preaching may sound hard? Oh, God, but it's out of love. Sometimes because of how serious it is, Lord, you have to snatch somebody out of the fire or push them out of the way in the name of Jesus. Father, I pray in the name of Jesus that you minister to your people and reveal your word continually unto them. In Jesus' name, amen. Praise God. Amen.